What's up, y'all? I want to take this quick intermission to, uh, to give a shout out to people in Houston, man. Big praise go out to you guys. I know you guys are going through a lot, man. Hurricane Harvey took a lot from you guys. All those flash floods, tons of rain. I seen the videos, man, so my heart definitely go out to you guys. So I went ahead and donated. I submit my donation through Google, and Google will match whatever you submit. I also did one through my job. My job is also matching 100%. My donation reach everyone who's in need of it. I'm also going to continue contributing. I have a friend who's going to be rounding up some goods to send to Houston to people they know. I'm probably going to try to throw some goods with that, maybe some clothes, whatever I have that can help anyone out. At this point, it doesn't even matter if it's brand new, old, as long as people get stuff that they need. Being a parent myself, I know I saw a lot of kids, man, and I can't imagine going through that with children. It must be the worst feeling, man. So, Houston, keep your head up, man. And um, you guys can get through it. You know, we've been through a lot. Katrina, Sandy in New York. Uh, Katrina, obviously, in New Orleans, man. And uh, I think they're estimating this probably the worst, the worst natural disaster that the United States have had. Regar regardless if it is or not, let's just hope we can recover from that, man, and help everyone make it out safe, help everyone reunite with their family, and uh, get back on their feet. All right? Salute. What's poppin' homies? It's your boy Frank Nitty, and I'm back in the building, literally I'm back in the building inside my room. Today I'm gonna bring you my recent pickups, man. As y'all know, my last video I went to the outlet. Majority of you guys already know what I probably cop, man. For the people who didn't watch that outlet video and watch this video for the first time, if you don't know, this is what your boy picked up at the Nike outlet clearance in Orlando, Florida. These joints right here. These are the Jordan 1 High High not high OG, high. These joints came out 2016, I believe, February. This is an all-star shoe. This shoe is supposed to be like, resemble a passport. Um, as you can tell, you have the digital print on the upper heel, on the medial side. You got the Jordan Wings logo on the outside. You got a gray swoosh on both sides of the shoe. It's predominantly all black. And you have a translucent outsole. The leather on the shoes is uh, could be better. Black laces with a chrome tip. And you can't forget the Jordan on the heel. That's how you know it's a mid, right? Obviously, no Nike Air on the on the toe tag. Not at all. You got the Jumpman logo on the toe tag. So, yeah, these shoes, as you guys know the story, if you have it, man, a few outlets back, I picked these shoes up. It was a size 11. I went to, like, three different outlets thinking that it's going to have this shoe in my size for some reason. They did it. I ended up returning them at the end of the day after striking out on all outlets, only to return three weeks later and they have my size. And it was the only size. I'm like, yo, when I asked you guys three weeks ago if you had this in my size, you said no. I went on this aimless chase to find my size and I failed. I only come back three weeks and just chill on the shelf like, no one even touched them, looked at them. But anyways, man, I'm happy to have this in the collection. I do like this shoe. I just like black shoes. I'm not a big crazy fan of Miz, but this shoe just do it for me, man. I do like this shoe, man. I do like this shoe. Oh, you guys probably want to know what I paid for this, right? Peep it. I paid $79 for this shoe. There was no additional discounts. I think I finessed it with $10 coupon. So I probably got $10 off on this shoe. I know I did. I know I did. Um, I'm going to call up and see when the next time they have 30%. Because your boy's going to take the shoe back and they're going to credit me 30%. Usually when they have sales, you bring back the shoe within the two weeks during the day of the sale. They would credit you whatever discount they currently was running off the shoe that you purchased. But it got to be within two weeks, right? Anyways, man, let's move on to the next shoe because I'm not done. Next, I got this box. As you can tell by the tape, it's a Nike box. It came from Memphis, but that's not the original destination from this box. This shoe was ordered from a sneaker shop in Las Vegas. And you're probably wondering, probably Urban Necessity, right? Nah, this is a different shoe shop. Um, if you guys follow Sneaker Steals on Instagram, they always post good deals daily. And at the last minute, he posted these shoes with additional discount. And you just had to do a phone order. So I called them up, they had my size, and I was able to obtain these joints. I was gonna hold out for them, but I was like, I couldn't wait, man. The price was good, it's the price I would have paid. And here's the receipt. Um, See, you got my address on it, so I'm not gonna post it. And he do got tape on the box. Who still tapes the boxes, bro? That's the receipt. Let's get these shoes out the box. Peep the size, peep the model. 
And also, if you look on the left hand side, this side, you can probably tell where it came from. But yeah, there's a Jordan 1. And if you guys who can read colorways on boxes, you already know what shoe this is. And for y'all who don't, it is the Jordan 1 Essential Pack All Black Joints, man, with the red laces, with the Nike Air tag on the tongue. All black silhouette, man. And the leather on these are butter, man. Butter, man. You got the laces rolled up. That's unique. I like my laces like this better than the oval. You know what I mean? Oh, anyways, get the other shoe out. I got the all white ones. Now I got the black ones, man. Definitely, definitely, definitely loving this. So happy to have these in the collection. I couldn't wait. And your boy's probably gonna double up, man. If these hits clearance, if these hits Nike for a dope price for like an under 100, I'm definitely gonna buy another pair, man. I actually love these shoes. I love black shoes. I don't know, and I'm also a big fan of Jordan 1s, man. It's not much to go over on the shoe, man. It's an all black shoe, black outsole. The only thing that's different on this shoe, you gotta hit some, the Nike Air on the tongue, which is a is in red. But pretty much, man, that's it, man. It's blacked out all the way through, bro. All the way through. But the leather on here is tumble on the side panel, on the toe box, man, on the back heel. It's pretty good leather, man. Pretty good leather. Definitely happy to have these in my collection. So pretty much, man, that makes two pickups in the last week, man. I copped those at Nike Clarence. I ordered these from a shoe store um, over the phone, phone order um, in Las Vegas somewhere. They shot, shoot it to me, seven day delivery. I think it took about seven days, man. Got them for cheap. I play 129 ship, so that's a good feeling. I definitely got them on the retail. Man, if you guys watching me towards the end, man, go ahead and hit that thumbs up if you haven't already, man. Go ahead and do so. I appreciate it. Pretty much it for my pickups, man. Obviously, I got the All Stars from the Nike Clarence. Got them for a great steal. I got these below retail for another great steal. Happy with my pickups. And if you guys are new to this channel, man, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and that notification bell as well if you want to know when I drop a new video. For my day ones, man, go ahead and hit that thumbs up. It really means a lot. Until then, y'all, good to go.